Hi everyone, this is Ashley with Brain Trust Tutors. Today I'm going to be showing you how to share the roll and read games with your students on pencil spaces. You will want to navigate to the whiteboard for this by clicking on the back to board button in the lower left hand corner of your screen. From there, you're going to copy and paste the link um, for the roll and read PDF into your web viewer tool. And this does take a couple seconds for it to load. And once you have this, um, just remember that all of your directions for the games are included on that first page. So depending on how you want to uh, play the game with your students, those instructions are included. And for the roll and read games, you will need dice and tokens to play. So once you have the particular roll and read game pulled up, you're then going to go ahead and go to the open apps, which is right above your um, insert web viewer tool. And if you click on that, it will actually give you a whole list of different apps that you can use inside of Pencil Spaces. And uh, if you just do a quick search and type in Dice, it will actually bring up the Dice feature for you to use with your Roll and Read game. And if you click on it, um, you'll just have to do a little bit of resizing real quick. And a little bit of rearranging, but very easy. And to use the dice, you will want to make sure that you click on the green die on the top of the small toolbar and drag it over. So that'll give you and your students your dice to play the game. And in order to roll the dice, you and your students will click on the two dice that are included in the small toolbar. And when you click on that, your dice um, will roll. And then in order to use tokens for your roll and read game, you can actually go ahead and use the shape tool at the bottom of the screen right down here. So if you click on that, that'll actually um, bring up a whole bunch of different shapes that your students can pick which shape they want their token to be. Um, if you have students that maybe Two of them want to be the same shape, not a problem. If they um, click on the shape, they can go ahead and add their token. And then if they use this tool right here, they can actually go ahead and change the color of their token. So you can have one student, maybe they wanna be a blue star, and maybe you have another student that maybe wants to be a red star. That's not a problem at all. So that is how you can use the dice and the tokens for your roll and read games, how you can share them on pencil spaces with your students. If you have any questions, please feel free to reach out to me at ashley at braintrusttutors.com. Thanks so much and have a great day.